Since its inception in 1994, the University of Exeter's Centre for Water Systems has been delivering world-class programmes and expertise, building a leading international reputation and winning sizeable funding for its cutting-edge research. We are focusing mostly on urban water cycle and what we call hydroinformatics. So it's the use of advanced information and communication technologies in order to better manage our water. From you know, predicting rainfall forecasting uh, to where that rainfall is going to fall and then cause potential flooding, to how better to provide security for water supplies um, in a city. The centre brings together researchers from civil, environmental, computational and other areas of engineering. As the largest group of its kind in the UK and one of the biggest in the world, it's built a strong reputation with industry partners and sponsors. It's one of the five centres of excellence in the UK selected to deliver advanced training as part of a collaborative industrial doctoral centre funded by the Engineering and Physical Sciences Research Council. For my industrial uh, supervisors, you got a really good um, links with different um, um, customers in the industry. So I got more exposure to the customers to understand what they really need from new research and development. And for my academic supervisors in here in Exeter, they have superior knowledge in artificial intelligence. That really helped me a lot in doing my research project. The Centre for Water Systems is committed to practical application for both undergraduate and postgraduates. Here at the Victorian Venford Reservoir in Devon, postgraduate students used fluid dynamics and civil engineering skills to help create a new spillway. So the design that has been made at the university was to uh, build an additional spillway structure on the side of the dam, uh, which will uh, handle the water which was underestimated 100 years ago when, when the dam was built. And also students uh, have been involved in that solution. They also looked at anchoring the dam, uh, environmental impacts and, and uh, some optimization of what solution should be adopted with regard to preempting the dam when the big flood comes and so on. With a world-class reputation in training engineers to meet the critical global needs for affordable and sustainable water management systems, the centre attracts many international students. I'm doing some kind of optimization in operation and design of um, urban wastewater systems in an integrated framework, including the sewer systems, wastewater treatment plants and the rivers, under the future climate changes and urbanization growth, which is one of the major concerns in water systems. With leading research-driven expertise in systems modelling, optimization, and decision support, the Centre for Water Systems continues to win major grants from councils, governments and industries from across the globe. I lead one large EU-funded project called COFU, Collaborative Research on Resilience to Flooding in Urban Areas, which involves 17 partners, including some from Asia. It looks at how we can uh, we in Europe, how we can learn from what's being done in Asia and how they can use technologies developed here. It's a four-year project. We do quite a lot of work with the UK water industry, with European partners and much wider. We have European projects that they extend to India, Taiwan, uh, Korea. That international recognition, together with extensive world-class facilities and award-winning research, will ensure the reputation and success of the University of Exeter's Centre for Water Systems continues to grow.